Hello, in this video we're going to do a quick demo on uh, connecting to the ESP8266 to the Raspberry Pi as we're going to have the ESP8266 integrated to the Pi18650 hat. So we're going to do a quick setup and uh, show you how to communicate. Uh, here we have the uh, Raspberry Pi quad core and a Nextdoc uh, interface. We're going to launch Minicom sudo com dash s um, we got to set up the serial port so a serial port should be dev tty ama zero and we have to turn off hardware flow control that's f so we want that off and we want the baud rate e to be 9600 on this module maybe it's different on yours you'll have to try you know what 9600 or 115 200 so right now it's set 9600 a to n1 so that's good um, push enter <coughs> we're going to save as default VFL and we're going to exit so we're at the command line so you can turn on your caps lock on your keyboard we're going to type in some AT commands for the ESP8266. So we press hold the control key, letter M, and then J, and it responds with an OK. So we're talking to the ESP8266. Uh, we're going to check the firmware version, AT plus GMR, control M, J, and there's our version there. And we're just going to do a quick test to see which Wi-Fi networks are available. Um, let's see what uh, we'll have to change the uh, the mode to station. So we AT plus C W mode equals one. Control M J. So we're already in uh, mode one, which is a station. Now we're going to check. Uh, what networks are available? AT plus CWLAP, Control M, J, and we should get a list of the Wi Fi networks available. So uh, we're also going to show you how to flash the ESP8266 using the Raspberry Pi, and we'll be providing some Python scripts, a class which you can include in your, your other Python code to basically automate the connection to the ESP8266. You can enter your information and uh, that way you can get your battery status and other sensor information up to your web page and so forth or turn off the Pi remotely. We're gonna show a demo for that. But for now, we're just uh, using the ESP-07, which has more pinouts than what we're using, but. We've ordered some modules and they haven't arrived yet, uh, but we can still do the software and show you how to get things going.